Marseille welcome Nîmes to the velodrome. In the reverse fixture back in August, the newly promoted side had beaten the Olympians 3-1. Fast forward seven months, and Marseille's hopes of getting European football were on the brink of being extinguished. Handed an opportunity by their rivals, Fopa, Rudy Garcia's team could put themselves back in contention. Nîmes were guaranteed survival and in good form, having won their last two games. Focus of this game, the return of captain Dimitri Payet. Payet getting a string of games under his belt after a lengthy absence through injury. And the home side looking for points. Started on the front foot, Mario Balotelli forcing Bernardoni to save from his early effort. The shot a little bit too central by the Italian. Florian Dovin, the ever-present danger man, then came close. But a deflection taking his strike above Bernardoni, but above the crossbar. Marseille kept on pressing. And Dimitri Payet took a free kick quickly, which sent Rajoncic on his way. An audacious little chip and a good save once again by Bernardoni. A first opportunity for the visitors to show their quality, a strike from range, but a good save from Stev Mandanda. One that you would expect him to make. Marseille with plenty of important games still coming, however, a little bit disgruntled to see Mario Balotelli pick up a muscular injury. The Italian replaced by Valer Germain. Concern over Balotelli's fate. Luis Gustavo then had his effort rebound off the post. It had taken a deflection, a big deflection, which took it away from Bernardoni. No goals at half-time at the Velodrome, but Marseille by far the better team and by far with the most chances. But Old Demons for the moment haunting Rudy Garcia and his team as they fail to score despite dominating the game. Tube forced Mandanda into an early save at the start of the second half. A good block by the French goalkeeper. Dimitri Payet delivered the ball for Valère Germain to open the scoring. 72nd minute for the substitute. Decisive once again for the Olympians. An excellent header at the front post. Too much power for Bernardoni. Two. Goals to the good for Marseille shortly afterwards as Gustavo's first effort was blocked. But what an absolutely fantastic piece of improvisation by the Brazilian. Luis Gustavo, a much appreciated man in Marseille. And a brilliant strike to leave Bernardoni scrambling. Lifting the ball over the Nîmes goalkeeper. Nîmes, however, who would have the opportunity to score one goal late on. Camera alleged to have handled in the box, and it is a good decision by the referee. Up stepped Teji Savanier, usually deadly from the penalty spot, and once again, too accurate for Stev Mandanda. penalty which in the end would have no consequence on the score of the match a vital three points for Marseille and job done for Rudy Garcia the Olympians give themselves a chance of still qualifying for Europe they next travel to Gargan on Saturday